The Chicago teen who killed a man with a gun while his mother was being attacked is now fully supported by Nikki Minaj, who has offered to pay for his college expenses. Welcome back it's your host Nancy Brown, if you are new here make sure you have subscribed to our YouTube channel. The viral case, which has generated a lot of discussion online over the past week or so, was brought up by the rapper. She spoke out on Instagram, and it's obvious that she thinks the 14-year-old and his mother did nothing wrong in this situation even if it resulted in the loss of a life. Nikki emotionally writes, that 14-year-old boy that backed dad hammer out when that grown-ass man was punching his mother in the face as if she were a man, is a true hero. She continues, If he wants to go to college, I'd love to help. It's what any son should have done for their mother. She raised a dope kid and should be so proud. Also, God knew before she knew that she'd be attacked that day and made sure they had protection on deck. She didn't really go into detail about her offer of help with higher education, but it's safe to assume she's talking about money. It will be interesting to see if the kid takes her up on it if he sees this. The case itself is a difficult one. Following the teen's June 18th shooting and death of 32-year-old Jeremy Brown at a restaurant, Carlicia Hood and her son were both charged with first-degree murder. Inside, there was a fight that saw Brown repeatedly punch Hood in the head. Her son walks inside the restaurant and starts shooting at Brown as he is wailing on her. Cops claim that Brown then fled, but Hood's mother claims that her son was directed to carry out her instructions and continue shooting Brown outside. Brown was shot and died as a result. Cook County prosecutors dropped all charges against the mother and son in the midst of a huge uproar, claiming they lacked sufficient evidence to proceed with the prosecution. Hud has since sued the city of Chicago and a few police officers, claiming that she was wrongfully detained or charged and that the entire experience left her in a great deal of emotional distress. Her legal team has been making the same claims that many others have made. That's it for today, thanks for watching. Tell us what you think in the comment section and most importantly subscribe. See you.